Alright, hello everyone, this is Vintage Problem Guy. In today's video, I'm going to be doing Mini System Test number 16 with the Simplex 4001 Final Control Panel. So, anyway, let's go ahead and let's get started. So, so right here you can see for the panel, everything's all normal, no troubles or any of that stuff. So, yeah, you can see that the batteries, so... I apologize, but I haven't really talked to any of my uh, mini system tests lately. Um, I know the reason I haven't really uploaded a whole lot. I think for like the past few weeks, I've just been like so busy with work and a ton of other things I've been going on with life. So I apologize for having to upload in the last few weeks. So I've just been incredibly busy with things in life. So yeah, but other than that, you know, since I had uh, some alone time, I can actually be able to make a mini system test for you guys. So. Yeah, so this would be kind of nice, so. Um, yeah, so I guess without further ado, I guess we'll hook, go ahead and get things started with devices. Get it started with devices here. So up at the pull station spot right here, we obviously have a, uh, uh, kind of a new device. Well, it's not really new, because I've had it for, like, I guess almost a year or half a year. Um, this is a Honeywell, uh, I think the model is like S404, no, 464 some, so I don't know. I'm not sure what the model of this pull station is. I don't know. I'll have to check it inside for the label. So, um, next up, we do have the uh, the Simplex 2098 key switch, like usual. Right here, we got the Fenwall uh, CBD 7021 uh, smoke protector. And then right up here, we have my Wheelock 7002T 24 with the good old black sounder plate in it. So, it's pretty cool. So, now for the cone for this uh, mini system test, system will be only doing continuous because like I said, this is the only cone option this device obviously sounds on because it's a, you know, because the strobe on this thing obviously does skip with the horn or whatever, so, yeah, so this basically this test, we're only going to be doing continuous, so. Yeah, so, I guess without further ado, I guess let's get on to the fun part, testing out the fire alarm system, so, um, if you do suffer from epilepsy to any flashing strobe lights or flashing lights, please do not watch this video. And please do not pull firearms to public buildings or tamper with life safety equipment. I am not responsible for your actions if you choose to do so. Alright, so anyway, let's go ahead and let's pull a fire alarm. So you can see we have zone one has been activated, so go ahead and set the pulse station. Now I don't actually know know if any of you guys actually noticed, but yeah, I actually hooked the the LED light um on the key switch up to the signal next circuit up the notification points. I don't know if any of you guys actually recognize that, but yep. Oh yeah, here's the model of this pulse. So it's the yeah, it's S four hundred sixty four A. Pulsation, so yeah, it's the inside of it. So yeah, so yeah, that was the pulsation. So now let's go ahead and activate the smoke protector. So that was the detector. See the light is illuminated. So uh, let's go ahead and activate the last device on the mini system. The uh, key switch right here. Here it goes. Alright, so as you can see, 
all three zones are in the alarm except for the fourth zone, which is now hooked up. Hopefully, I might see if I could try to get something for the the fourth zone hooked up. Maybe like a two stage pull station, for example. But I don't know. I think for right now, I'm just gonna have that. I just have to end the line resistor on zone four, not in use right now. So, but yeah, hopefully, and hopefully, some point, if I, maybe I'll put a two stage pull station up on the system. And maybe I can see if I can hook the two stage portion of the pull station up to zone four, then probably make it a lot more interesting. So it'd be pretty cool. So alright. So now as we activate all the devices on the mini system, we could go ahead and reset the panel. Alright. Alright, so that will do it for mini system test number 16. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you all next next time in the next video. Alright, peace.